Hello everyone, my name is Šimlo Maraček and this is Project One for CS50's uh, mobile app development with React Native. I apologize for the quality of video, but I had to take it on my camera. Uh, screencast would be bad because my microphone and laptop is uh, in bad shape. Uh, the goal of this project is Pomodoro timer. It should uh, display minutes and seconds in the in the text, it should uh, start and count down until it reaches zero. Uh, it should buzz when it reaches zero. It should switch between 25 and 5. Uh, I can show this manually. Later I will show it uh, uh, how it does automatically. It should start. Uh, uh, it starts, as you can see. It should pause or stop, uh, as you can see. And it should restart. So let's see the code. Now let's start at the beginning. Uh, to show the functionality, I will make uh, I have my number, uh, which is rendered, is in seconds. So 25 minutes times 60 seconds. I will put this put here just 10 seconds, and for break just five seconds. And as you can see, when I hit start, it will come down until zero and the buzzing is the vibrating I cannot show but uh, it switches to break uh, it switches to break which is five seconds you can see five seconds ship uh, so let's see the state uh, the state is composed of uh, work count which takes the default value of work uh, there is a break count which takes the default value of break uh, if the time is running the running is true now it's true uh, if I hit pause now the running is false if we are on the breaking screen, the working is false. If we are on the working screen, break, working is true. Now is rendered on the screen and interval, uh, which is uh, running the clock. If uh, you see the render, uh, header takes the working. If we are on the working, it uh, renders work. Uh, if we are on the breaking, the working is false. It uh, renders break. Then there is counter which takes the now and renders the now. Uh, uh, the number is in seconds, so uh, to see the minutes correctly, divided by 60, as, uh, divided by 60. and to see the seconds, uh, modulo 60. Uh, if the number is less than two digit long, it adds zero before it. Uh, Okay, then we have buttons. Uh, if the time is running, uh, there is a pause button. If the time is not running, running is false, there is a start button, and there is a restart and switch. When you hit the start button, start counter fires, start counter makes the running, uh, running state true, and initiates interval. interval. Uh, if the working is true, we are on the working screen, it decrements work. If the working is false, it decrements break. Uh, decrement work uh, method, let's see. Uh, it decreases uh, uh, work count, it gives the same value to the now to be rendered. When it hits zero, it vibrates. Uh, on the phone, if you run the code, it will vibrate when it hits zero. And when it hits zero, uh, it uh, resets uh, break count to default value of break which was the constant you can you could see above this one and uh, changes the working to false as we are going to do uh, breaking screen uh, the interval is still running so it just checks the working working variable the working is now false so decrements break decrements break is the same as work decrement work it decrements uh, break count, gives it to value, gives it to now to same value, it gives it to now to be rendered. When it when the now hits the zero, it vibrates, and the same when it hits zero, it switches to gives the work count the default value of work, as we are going again and working to true, as we are going to the working screen. The restart counter uh, restarts. Uh, restarts the counter. If you are on the working screen, it restarts the work count and uh, gives it to, gives the same value to now. If you are on the breaking screen, it restarts restarts the 
if the working is false, it restarts break count and gives it gives the same value to now to be rendered. Stop counter, uh, clear the interval, and uh, sets the running uh, running state to false as this it stops the time. Uh, switch counter if we are on the working screen, the working uh, make makes the work uh, false and resets the uh, breaking screen. If we are going to the breaking screen, it resets the default values. If uh, we are on the breaking screen, the working is false. It sets the working to the true and uh, restarts the working count and now to the default values. Uh, that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. Hit the like button and subscribe. And see you in the next one.